It's time now for our weekly feature from our partners at Scene Uptown Magazine. Each week, fashion editor Joey Hull will take us to hot spots and hip happenings around the QC. Tonight, he's on the trail of women with beards in Noda. Hey guys, it's Joey Hull. I'm in North Davidson to chit chat with some women that. Eh, see them, but I'm going to take you there anyway for the Beards Because Fashion Show. Let's go check it out. What kind of women are involved in this fashion show? Uh, extremely hot women. but Well, hopefully, because they're on a fashion show, but yeah. what, what's, what's unique about them? The unique portion is that they'll all be wearing beards. Is it their personal beard? Uh, you know, some of them, we really, we really didn't go out and look for those women, and so we're helping the ones out that don't already have the facial hair to back it up on stage. Ah, sexy. Yeah. Very, very sexy. <laughs> Beards Because supports the uh, local Charlotte Battered Women's Shelter. So all that money will end up there. Uh, domestic violence has gone under the uh, radar and been swept under the rug too long, and we thought it was important for uh, a group of men to give it a voice here in Charlotte. Yeah, now I'm going to the, the kissing booth and the tarot card reader, and then are you going to have any, like, flamethrowers, or what are they? Are they is it flamethrowers? Is that what you call them? Is this where you insert a pride weekend joke? No. About the flamethrowers? No. Is this where you wanted that? You're the one that's about flamethrowers and sword swallers and bearded ladies on the same weekend I as gay pride, nothing. friend. I... I am in marketing. All right, I've given you a sneak peek at what's to come this Saturday. The rest is all up to you. Make sure to check it out at Amos's. This is Seen on the Edge. I'll see you there.